Hello, this is the use of performance management at Pancho's Mexican restaurant. Performance management, Dr. Dion Sanchez, Aaron Bernadac, Aberdeen University, and this is my graduate project. So, I wanted to start with an introduction and I wanted to identify basic but important keywords um, restaurant managers, restaurant own owners, concerns, key issues, human resources hospitality, administration, and economic environment, long-term problems that can be maximized by the current environment, constellation of government, regulation, taxation, legal liability, and performance management, key issues of concern from lodging managers and project managers. Pancho's Restaurant, basically class and Dr. Dion my main focus, I wanted to demonstrate the Pancho's restaurant in the heart of Memphis offer traditional and modern Mexican food. Um, they develop under the direction of Gonzalo Martinez in the heart of Memphis. The main goal is to give customers, us, an experience, an unforgettable experience. So the restaurant offer a fun, happy, and festive environment with authentic music, food, and decor. The restaurant is transformed into a Mexican hacienda plus cantina and bar. More than 120 tequilas, margaritas, and good entertainment. The restaurant offers Mexican food with attention to quality, authenticity, rich uh, culture, flavors, culture awareness, and diversity. The methodology. I What I did, I collect and analyze data and information to explain and, and, and really understand the system within the restaurant since I have no idea how a restaurant work. Um, I'm a consumer but I never um, consider how um, you know what type of problems or performance system they develop so I started with an open-ended information or survey to determine qualitative analysis of the restaurant managers and owner. I develop different components of grounded theory that serve as the main foundation for the qualitative field study. I gather different reviews and different journal, I mean, different um, some articles and journals to better understand the system and to and to develop an effective performance um, system that they can use. The differences between the owners, operators, and managers, which is the different kind of techniques that they use. Okay, the topic question, I was debating a little bit because it has, you know, um, a restaurant has so many topics, uh, so it was hard to, to pick a topic question, but I guess the design component will develop a successful performance system and effective employee development, particularly Pancho's Mexican restaurant. So, in other words, I wanted to demonstrate that in a time of economic instability and international turbulence, it is worth examining what issues most worry restaurant um, operators, owners, and managers because they find themselves struggling with long-term issues or problems that can be only magnified by the current environment. Research questions. What are the disadvantages of poorly implemented performance system? What is the evaluate, evaluating vision and mission statements at Pancho's Restaurant? What are the management units and organizational priorities of Pancho's Restaurant and the main implications for addressing performance problems? The mission statement that I gather from Pancho's Restaurant in the heart of Memphis is to operate as a high-performing financial restaurant dispensing superior services, food, and customer services. The goal is to retain outstanding staff who are motivated and productive. That was one of the things that I find out about the restroom. The retention of outstanding staff who are motivated to create and produce a good healthy environment and customer whole service is limited. Uh, the strategy they review and analyze its existing departments and performance that are constant in their objectives strategies and action plans so in other words they do evaluate the previous work from other from other uh, from other performance 
The mission is to expand the knowledge and management abilities, the strategic planning and decision making abilities, so that project all managers decrease losses and other operating expenses while increasing the effectiveness of the branching systems. The position they want to reinforce a comprehensive human resource system to certify the motivation and strategic planning and division staff members, individual performance, develop responsibilities, standards, and actions to be taken. Performance management. So Poncho's restaurant issues or problem. This is where I this is where the information gets a little tricky because I found many problems not only in Pancho's restaurant but I'm in different restaurants ar around Memphis but I focus in Pancho's because it is a cultural um, restaurant um, where different people from diverse ethnic backgrounds go uh, but I feel like it was the most effective restaurant from human resources and um, government regulations etc so some of the problems that I find out um, at restaurants especially Pancho's was the managers are not focused on meeting important goals in other words they don't have meetings every week they don't have meetings every month where they discuss with the employees you know the main standards or the main objectives um, employees don't really have enough decision-making power or authority like if they have a suggestion or like an effective strategy they can help um, the system um, the owners don't really give them the voice or empower them to express their ideas and thoughts communication is limited between employees and managers and the organization structure of the restaurant is weak that's one thing that it was pretty um, noticeable the organization the organizational culture hinder motivation and entrepreneurial behaviors why do I say that because the majority of the people working at Pancho's restaurant are undocumented individuals meaning that they feel like their voice um, don't really I mean it's not going to create a change because um, they're, they're like there can be threats uh, there can be threats that you know they can be um, well they can be deported um, or they can they lose in a motivation um, or behavior because they feel insecure about their residency or citizenship in the state so that's that was something that I try not to pay attention but I noticed that that's truly affecting people um, and the way they view things and their relationships so the relationship of the suppliers is not likely to change the strategies and food services of the competitors affect Pancho's own strategies and product services so in other words Pancho's has a lot of competition Pancho's it's in the heart of Memphis downtown and fortunately there are several restaurants um, like Red Robin or Olive Garden or Bahama Breeze etc many well-known restaurants around that plaza so Pancho's is constantly promoting themselves through advertisement or um, or like word by mouth or the radio station or something because they don't have enough customers there are confusion between individual goals there are a um, misalignment of organizational and functional units so in other words the relationship um, is not likely to change and the organization again the organization structure is very weak and limited I gather my information from literature review so current knowledge about Pancho's restaurant I searched the history including substantive findings published information about performance um, I focus on the behavior oriented performance standards that way I can understand the current performance reviews of the restaurant performance planning and performance renewal so I gather a census of different literary review the prerequisites so some of the prerequisites that I find out and this is where I develop my information um, I include observation methods which include the job um, analysis in other words watching people on the job or even trying to do the work themselves and then producing a description of what they what they observe so in other words I develop and design an effective performance system um, gathering the restaurant mission and a strategic goals and having the knowledge of the job and performance and management because again I, I didn't I didn't know what was the, ana the um, analysis of the functionality of a restaurant um, I feel that reinforced performance and management with the following characteristics is really important so we need to have the restaurant needs to have a strategic congruency accountability 
openness for suggestions, um, a, standard, a standardization for different assessments, validity, productivity, and reliability for any assessments or measurements. It's important to have those things. Also, part of the prerequisites was a cooperation between people, operation, and financial to complement each other and to implement new ideas. Um, to develop appropriate expectation and communication, ponchos should express clear expectation along with positive and constructive um, like feedback. Uh, the reviews, they analyze how employees are responding under one single direction. Part of the prerequisites is to have the knowledge the manager express and the need to develop an image of food as rewarding. The issues by many restaurants, human resources, recruiting, benefits, motivation, retention, training, compensation, immigration, again, satisfaction, interpersonal conflicts, workers, compensation, taxation, and government regulations, all these issues are affected by restaurant responding. I asked a group of people and they were not happy with the way human resources is working. They were not happy how do they recruit people, how do they train people, the compensation, um, it's not there obviously. The majority of the people, you know, like don't have a stable legal immigration because I can completely relate to that as well. The satisfaction or the in interpersonal conflicts with other workers is constantly happening. The taxation is really high and there are government regulation and standards in the state of Tennessee that affects Poncho's restaurant. Um, some of the skills, um, performing routine, maintenance on food, objectives, and services and strategies and determining what kind of implementation is needed it was something that I noticed time management working time and adjusting actions and plans in relations to other workers the judgment and decision making um, is considerably you know we need to consider the costs and benefits of potential potential actions and critical thinking develop logic and effective reasoning to recognize the strength and weaknesses of alternative solutions or approaches to different problems performance planning. Um, this is where I was trying to identify the areas that need supervision and improvement, which obviously I just discussed, and uh, implementation of the performance system. The um, performance review enhances the ability to adapt to different environments changes, so I think it was important for the restaurant to have an effective performance review. It allows for new options, ideas, and opportunities for growth and development the comprehension of the details inside the performance management it is essential for the manager and his project team that will be overtaking full responsibility of, of completing the project I say this because there is going to be a change in manager and if the manager don't have the comprehension of details and the comprehension of a complete performance management system he or she won't be able to complete the task so they have to know what are the detailed goals the business value for the organization or the restaurant the objectives needed to be completed the, the roles the responsibilities of the workers the stakeholders if any and the level of, of authority for himself the level of authority is very important because the authority has to have a direction if the authority don't have a direction it becomes a problem because the manager is in the position to initiate the preparation for the next phase into performance management um, the project or the restaurant must be planned in alignment with strategic goals of the organization and the manager work he must diligently work and analyze and collect as much information as possible to assure the level of implementation needed for performance and management it was very important to it was very important to understand that and to and have a thorough performance management um, planning process. Um, we, the manager has to understand the project chatter and the project chatter is I thought that it was beneficial for them to have a project charter where is a document with initial scope information. Um, the project serve as a guide for everyone. I mean everyone can relate um, and everyone can look for information. Um, in case, um, in, I mean, in case they have questions. So, without a proper charter, there's no guide, there's no direction, and even in a restaurant. So, um, if the risks aren't documented, analyze, compare, and measure against the original baseline charter, how can the project manager and project team base can change the measurements for any missing information? In other words, Dato Sanchez and classmates. How can the project or the restaurant 
manager along with this project can change or cause measurements or something if they have missing information or if they don't have a baseline or a charter or a document where they can establish all the goals to implement effective performance management. Uh, decision making was kind of all over the place in the restaurant. Uh, there were meetings throughout the project life cycle, but I thought meetings are intended to review and analyze and ultimately validate or make decision about something. That's where I got my information from Adams. Um, it's the author and any meeting uh, missing information make it difficult to make decision and you know in order to move forward essentially the project serves as an anchor leading to way to proper objective fulfillment in other words a well structured project does show a sense of dedication by the organization express the need and desire for a successful complementing their project so in other words taking into consideration for project documentation gives a sense that everyone's voice was heard that was important for me to emphasize your voice can be heard you can you can have effective strategies and ideas put it on the task Pancho's restaurant needs an effective project charter with effective goals roles and responsibilities and identifies core values customers products and shareholders it's not just a job but they need to realize that the critical like it's critical to have that knowledge and, and to be consistent in order to be successful. The execution process defining the performance scope involves identifying and determining and documenting the restaurant goals, um, features, functionalities, requirements, and anything else to fulfill product deliverance for the developmental process. So I think estimating the schedule has to be done in a proper in a proper um, time and order that was part of the execution process. Um, the restaurant must be able to provide an accurate schedule of activities based on time frame in order to have a successful and accurate estimation. In other words, the integration of project management introduce formulas, evaluate time and duration to assure the original baseline is intact. In other words, I wanted to incorporate some formulas um, because for the project uh, restaurant or management, it's important to evaluate the the time the schedule the scope and the cost you know like how much um, the restaurant is spending money in what kind of material what is the study method um, you know was determined like without direction into particular force or answer there will be you know there will, like there will be an issue so the approach should be intended to exp um, explain and and um, develop relationships between owners and managers and why is important so the so the restaurant manager and project team his project team uh, they must work together to ensure the requirements are meet by monitoring and controlling the production of each um, deliverable but executing the project management and execution process in the performance management process and I have some little pictures there explain that the job has to be done by achieving the objective. That's what I, that's what I explained. I mean, the uh, the employees has to have an idea of the goals, and maybe and they have to be able to create those conditions. But the manager must motivate and and confront any correcting problems in performance management system. Um, the effective performance must be included in a midterm to ensure and review that performance is on track. Um, so it has to be execution, but personal l leadership and interpersonal leadership has to be included to have a high performance individual organization. The part of the execution, this was, I guess, my one of my favorite parts because um, the managers was able to focus on and listen and provide solid support in combination with good resource negotiator and good listeners opened the door for effective project management. Um, Turvey 2006 um, described that project managers or restaurant managers often do not have a direct authority over their performance system. So again, they don't have direction and direction is such an important thing before, before anything can happen and, and people can go forward. So the skills, the people's skills are crucial and extremely important and the team is concerned and should be concerned on the management system because 
the management system should use matrix management where they um, where they can use and follow different um, like specific guidelines. People might prefer to be social or introverts, but certainly people can learn to adapt to specific situations and trigger appropriate behavior. In other words, um, it was important to me to realize that the key is not know what kind of behavior is required for a given circumstance but I mean they need to know that a given circumstance requires a certain specific um, ability so how this relate to the restaurant well good question it relates because the problems on the mind by asking people or managers to identify the one or two issues or problems that they find themselves worrying about most or wishing that they have a, a better way of addressing reveal that if they don't have a direction um, on whether going is going to be a problem. So that's where the employees with fresh ideas can involve and they can work together and, or they can develop a metrics management where they create responsibilities and, and, and they better explain everything. Um, they need a combination and there was something that I spoke to the manager. They need interpersonal and conceptual skills which they can help them um, analyze each situation, um, interact appropriately, um, and they need a sense of leadership building and motivating the project team, communicating, influencing the project team, decision making, um, cultural awareness, negotiation, trust building, conflict management, and coaching. So I think coaching was another aspect of the project that I needed to address because the restaurant never coach or train people on important issues such as this. So the responsibilities involved communicating and getting things done on, on a timely manner, manner, I'm sorry, and within the budget. But still, I mean, as a restaurant, I mean, as a manager, there are certain skills that are a must and are important as ones to follow, such as leadership, um, which is the elaborate explanation of people's skills in a project restaurant. Uh, the negotiation, um, have good negotiation skills to resolve conflicts with other people or conflicts with the system, resources, food, etc. Human resources, government. Um, the project scheduling is one of the most important aspects because the manager can have a good idea on scheduling of activities and is able to lead the team in the proper direction. Communication, it was another skills um, because it is effectively allow sponsors and stakeholders and other people to make responsible communicating information regarding tax, plans, schedule, strategies, or stakeholders, if any. Time and cost management was another issue because the, the manager is responsible for managing the budget and to ensure that the budget is complete. Um, they should have, it is essential to have time and cost management skills. There are activities, meeting or expenses that will occur throughout the life of the project. So it's important to have that time and cost management strategies. The assessment. On the assessment, I evaluate safe appraisals. The restaurant look at previous feedback received and they are accomplished and initiated what they have launched. So they develop ways to enhance the skills and describe the new skills they have learned um, how the manager is going to apply these new skills and how they support the goals of the restaurant. So they have to share challenge, you know, provide practical insights to the workers, employees, and managers. So they can work together. Part of the assessment was the vast number of components in a project must be conducted, evaluated, and implemented to assure the project is completed um, to the objectives of the organization. Uh, this is important because of communication, of course, has to be clear and concise and it should have all the necessary information transmitted. Performance review. The purpose for monitoring and controlling performance management was to assure that quality activities are being inspected and measured to access performance and recommend the necessary changes if needed. So in other words, within the restaurant atmosphere, there are errors that are commonly found by checking work repeatedly. So they should check at the work appraisals, performance appraisals, and see, um, you know, if they're meeting, um, if 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 um, if the employee and the manager are meeting to accomplish and review assessments. So I think that's such an important issue. Um, another another aspect another aspect was 
to continue reassessment necessary to assure the smooth process of a project task and activity, in this case the restaurant. The project must conduct reassessment. That was another imperative thing to remember. The importance of clarifying for the project team to understand how to conduct risk assessments and avoid problems or concerns before even happen. Um, if the project failure will fall upon the project team who do not implement or perform control risks or processes. The scope and the scale of project can differ substantially and it can further be used to identify specific areas of performance management planning that might require review and improvement. In other words, the project monitoring outcome and impact indicators measure the population level or changes that coincide with the project activities, but these changes in within the restaurant um, are part of the results um, or the casual relationship is still unknown. In other words, evaluation measures the outcome and impact that can be reasonably attributed to product activities. The evaluation employs an experimental design um, to to show evidence and the effect of the project and of course that performance evaluation um, refers to less design and at the same time produce evidence of results. The performance renew and reconstructor uh, the renewal process should contain the objective of the change and it should be clearly documented and communicated to all individuals who will be impacted by the change. In particular, it is essential that the business objective is clear, understood by the sponsor, and the objective of the change must be clear at the start of the performance management. I think all participants or all people working in the restaurant must understand that ambiguity is a normal proce process of the change process, or oh, it's a normal part, I'm sorry, of the change process, but as the change progresses, the ambiguity will decrease and measurably benefits will be identified within the restaurant. The communication mechanism adopted for the project must be dynamic and be adjusted and needed to meet needs for change. Finally, the formal methods for managing change is essential on complex projects when the cost of failure is high and the probability of failure is real due to anticipating resistance to change. The change management methodology will increase the likelihood of successful implementing the changes associated with the project, which in this case is the restaurant. And I have a little model here, my strategy, the people, the process, the technology, my references. And it is important to notice, Dr. Ga I mean, Dr. Sanchez and in, in classmates, that performance management is an ongoing process. Um, it needs to be requisites that performance uh, planning, um, execution, assessment, review, renewal, and contracting. But the six component allow for planning to be aligned with organization goals, which in turn will lead to performance execution. So it has to be a good performance planning to have a good performance execution. The component involves um, the knowledge of the organization, the mission, and the strategic goals. And the knowledge can be combined with the mission and other strategic goals. Performance renew, I'm sorry, uh, performance execution, that's where the employees and the, and the managers of the restaurant are responsible for the performance execution. Um, they are they discuss important responsibilities, documentation, updating the employer on any changes in the goals of the organizations and providing resources and reinforcement so the employee can succeed and continue to be motivated. The employee and the superior, they must evaluate the employee performance and in regards, I mean, it provides information and self-appraisers to have a real understanding of what is expected from the employee and from 
the managers. And finally, the fifth and sixth component, uh, meetings should be called appraisal meeting, and meetings should emphasize what the employees have done in the restaurant, what problem, because I discussed a problem, but I mean, how can they develop strategies to better address those problems? And um, if there are any components that use this information in the review period to make adjustments as needed. I think this project more than ever um, requires a a strategic and general considerations of performance management to have a successful retention of customers, employees, but they need to, the restaurant ponchos need to restabilize community service, some of the employees, and they need to be reminded of the things that are important on the job analysis.